Hey guys, my name is Mary, and if you're new here, welcome to the shit show. Before we get started, I just wanted to wish you guys a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year's. And I know I'm posting this super late than everybody else on YouTube, but that's okay as long as it is late, then better than ever. I guess that's okay. If you hear crying in the background, it's because Blinky is staring at me right now from his cage, crying like a little baby. Do you guys hear that? I'm gonna show you. What's wrong, Blinky? What's wrong? First world problems of Blinky Marichal. Also, I can't find my tripod, so I'm using a suitcase plus a bunch of books to hold my camera. Alrighty guys, so before I get started, I have to throw in this disclaimer. This video is in no way, shape, or form a way to brag or to show off any of the things that I got for Christmas. I'm just very thankful for all the things that I got that Santa brought to me on the 25th and I just wanted to share it with you guys plus I'm super excited to try all these things out and I've been literally waiting till I film this video to actually use the things that I got for Christmas I put them all in a little bag right next to me right here and we're just gonna get on started alrighty guys so this thing you're probably wondering what in the world what is this Marianne why did Santa give you this and I'm gonna open it up for you guys Santa got this at Walmart his little elves did not make it this year so I wanted to show you what Santa got so I have been wanting a little mini sewing kit because my bed sheet has hole has a hole in it because they got ripped in the washing machine and then I also have a hole in a couple of my shirts that I want to fix and in a couple of my leggings so I got this old bad boy and it has like all the like literally every piece of whatever this is called that you need is in here so I'll be able to like fix all my clothing items without having to go to the store it comes with a bunch of needles like literally everything you need is in here and santa got it from walmart so if you're looking for one of these cool bad boys that just come with everything go to walmart go in the arts and crafts section and you will find either this one or the smaller version of it so this is one of the many things that i got from santa this year now this is what I've been waiting for. Guys, look how cool this is. Oh my gosh, this is actually a Starbucks candle. Santa got it from Etsy, in case you're wondering. Um, Santa and Natalie, I'm so, so freaking excited to light this up today. And it smells like Starbucks, like guys. You know how obsessed I am with Starbucks. And the fact that Santa got me a candle and it smells like Starbucks and it looks like Starbucks. I'm just like, damn Santa, I must have been really good this year for you to get me one of these. But this is just like one of the coolest things ever and I'm just so excited to light this and have it right next to my salt lamp and I just can't stop smelling it. It smells so good. I'm in love. Now, this is kind of random, but Santa threw this in um, our makeshift stocking. And so it, in case you don't know, it's a head massager and literally every single time I do this, I get chills. It feels so good, guys. Like I get goosebumps. I don't, if I wasn't wearing long sleeves, I could show you the goosebumps I literally get. Ah, the hairs on my legs are sticking up. This feels so good, guys. You don't understand. 
you guys just need to get yourself a head massager and just do this to yourself all day because this is the, one of the most amazing things that I never knew that I needed and I've been low-key using it every once in a while and I'm just gonna yeah I'll just be back guys I'll be right back um, massage my head. Now, Santa did some shopping for me, and so one of the first things is Santa went to Shein, which is a online store, and it got me a couple of things. The first thing is this cute little top, and it comes with this black string thing, and you just tie it together so people who have no boobs, like me, this will make your titties look fantastic if you know me personally you know that I'm always wearing walking socks so the fact that they could combine walking socks with unicorns I dropped it oops with unicorns is absolutely amazing and like the sparkles on it you they're like reversible so it could go from gold to silver like literally guys this is so freaking cute and look how cute this unicorn is it has this little you know it's horn and it's gold and it's ears and they're so soft and comfy you can see obviously i've kind of been wearing them around the house i don't like to wear sandals i like to wear walking socks in the house so this was literally the most perfect gift ever plus it's a unicorn so it's so freaking cute another piece of clothing item is kind of like it's a tube top but it has like these cute little straps um santa knows that winter does not exist here in miami florida so it got me this cute little tank top that i will probably most likely wear next week since it's going to be hot here like it is year round so this is another cute little unclothing item that I got. Santa this year really likes Shein. It's been, you know, low-key obsessing buying every single piece of clothing of item on there. Um, <coughs> Mom. Um, but she did, Santa did get me a really cute pair of jeans that I thought were so different, so unique. Um, on the back side, you know, they look like normal pair of skinny jeans, but when you open them, it is filled with all these little pearls. And I think they're so cute. Plus the material is so stretchy. It feels super nice. So I cannot wait to wear these. I think they're so adorable, so different, not like the typical jeans that I wear, which are always like rib jeans or boyfriend jeans. I think these are just something extra to add to my closet. All right, guys, so the next thing I got was these high-waisted, I was about to say black, oh my gosh, red skinny jeans, and they're super comfy, guys. They're stretchy, they literally fit so well and they make my butt look extra good all right guys so we like took a i would like to say a three hour break it is nighttime now what happened what happened marion well i'm supposed to have a business call which usually takes me like maybe 10 to 30 minutes and it lasted i kid you not two hours two but that's okay. You know, we ended up talking about the business. We talked about, you know, life, boys. And it was actually overall great conversation. So, yeah, spending two hours FaceTiming this girl. But it was also really good at the same time. So let's now get back to it. Alrighty, guys. We're almost done with the clothing. Um, nobody get weirded out by this. But every year Santa loves doing this. I think it is the best thing ever. When I was younger, I used to hate it, but Santa would always wrap, um, individually wrap our, um, forgetting what it's called when I have it right in my lap, is that he would wrap up our underwears, our bras, our socks, and then like individually wrap them and then put them in the tree, which was always fun to look for. But this year, I had already enough socks, I had enough bras, so 
Santa brought me some underwear and it's not any type of underwear guys it is this is I feel like this is weird to show but this is Calvin Klein underwear and it is so nice so I got this one in gray color I got this one which is a little bit different it's in blue and then it has this it's gray and then I got two black ones so I got some underwear I hope you guys aren't weirded out that I showed you that I got some underwear for Christmas because it was fun finding them in the tree in the visually searching for you know whether or not it was going to be socks or bras but it was underwear exactly what I needed so thank you Santa I really appreciate it even though when I was younger I did not appreciate it but now now the last thing that's kind of did you guys hear that that was my stomach I just drank a lot of water stomach wanted to say hello but anyways Santa brought me this it's like a clothing item but it's a workout item at the same time as you guys already know I am really big on yoga yoga's freaking life guys if you haven't implemented yoga what are you doing do some yoga right now after you watch this video and subscribe but Santa got me these socks and I know they look weird they're interesting they have them for each little toe I think they're hilarious and they're just like multicolor it's like we're rain it's like completely rainbow it's the rainbow flag but these socks they're not walking socks these are socks for when you do yoga so they stick like kind of on the floor and help you like have a grip and not slide all over the place because when you do yoga on regular socks you're slipping and sliding so these even though they're a very interesting type of color they're super good when it comes to yoga santa got them from shein if you're curious about buying your own definitely check it out from that website pretty much this whole entire video is about Shein and all the things I got through there. So Shein, if you're watching, sponsor me. I would appreciate it. But yoga. All right. So the next thing I got was this cute little travel case, and it says "Believe in yourself." It's really cute. It's perfect to put all of your makeup. I actually put all the little small items in here just so they wouldn't, you know. Mess, get messed up with all the other stuff that I had in this bag and so I'm going to show you everything that I actually had in this little bag and it's actually pretty spacious the fact that it fit all these things inside of you. Now the first thing is we're going to go and talk about jewelry. Now Santa did A1 this year and the fact that I didn't even mention this to Santa but I had been, you know, thinking, looking, um, wanting to actually go out and buy earrings. And the fact that I didn't and I actually got some and I got, I would say, some really cute ones. So let's start off with these pair. Like, look how cute they are, guys. Like, we have a little elephant. There's these cheetah ones. I don't even know what these are called the tassels I believe and they're just super cute and festive and like I just love these elephants and this cheetah one I'm just overall obsessed I love studs in general they're super easy plus I have three not three I'm going to get my third one very soon but I have you know two ears piercing and then I have my cartilage so I like to layer it up with studs so i'm super happy that i was able to get these cuties as well as many more which i will show you right now, now the next thing i got were all these studs and this is so cute guys like look at it it's we got them blues we got them grays we have some reds right here it is so so cute i cannot wear cannot wait to wear these again guys santa went freaking awol when it came to christmas this year and jewelry in general i'm just pushing this back but here is another set 
of studs that I got which is different from the typical diamond like you know the fake diamonds that I wear um, that I have and so these are just like this kind of just reminds me like Indian Aztec little vibes that I'm getting just in general with most of the earrings that I got but these are just again super cute they're from Shein thank you Santa so much I really appreciate it now another pair I promise like this is we have this one and another one of earrings that I'll be showing you guys but more studs now this one is super cute guys because it's kind of like it's the exact same design but it has different colors and so I absolutely love this. I love the fact that I have one in purple. You guys know that purple is my favorite color. Also I just realized something. Um, they messed up. So look at this design and then this design and then th these two are the exact same. But this one's different and yeah so she had messed up but that's okay um I, I still love them either way i think they're super cute now the last pair of earrings i got are these guys and guys like look at these these are hoops but then they have she shells at the bottom we have these cute little tassel and then these are hoops but instead they're like they have this little circle thing in the middle so they don't hang out like this like the typical hoop earrings do they're more like this and i don't even know if i'm explaining that right but just like you guys can see this is super freaking cute and you know they're from shein because where else would they be from because santa didn't use elves this year i think they were a little understaffed so he had to resource to online shop. Guys, I thought I was done with earrings, but then I realized I have this box. And there's a bunch of little earrings in here too. Not little, they're a little bit different. So I'm just gonna take them out for you guys so you guys can see it. I think these are super cute. They're different from one of the ones I just showed you, but it is this. So this is one pair of earrings that i got i have the other ones i don't think that santa just gave me this no of course it gave me the other pair then i also have these that are so cute as well then last but not least are these bad boys look how cute this is it's so different it's like abstract put on earrings now the last pair are these adorable green ones and you just kind of like place them like this so it looks like you have four ears piercing but really it's just moving on from earrings we are now going to get into I guess the nail beauty stuff so let's start off with this cute little thing um, it's like a little travel type of thing and it comes in this cute case. It's an apple and my favorite part is this little tiny mirror. It's so cute guys. You guys can see yourself in a reflection but it is so adorable. It comes with everything you need and it, it's in this adorable little apple so that's super cute the next thing is santa got me this nail filer in pink so i can file away my nails and stop stealing my mom's nail filers and all her nail stuff and actually have my own even though i'll probably continue to take hers but not only that santa got stuff for me to use on my toes and the bottom of my foot so i can scrub away some dead skin i honestly don't know how to use this and what this is for so i'm probably just gonna google or you guys can let me know how i use this and what this is exactly for i just know it removes the dead skin on your bottom of your feet but i don't know how to probably use it so it's gonna be a learning process it's gonna be an experience but santa also got me this and then this thing to take out I don't know how to say in English, but in Spanish, los pellejos. So, los pellejos que tengo on my nails, like this thing. Oh, cuticles! 
Is it cuticles? I don't even know. Um, but these things at the bottom of your nail that like builds up, yeah. So that's what one of these bad boys are for. And then it has the little metal side and then the little plastic side that you can push down, you know. You know what I mean? You know what I mean. Um, next thing that Santa got me was this Sonic Facial Cleansing Brush. Um, I really don't know how I'm supposed to use it. But it's battery operated and it. I'm trying to open it but clearly I'm failing to do so. Okay, I guess we're not just opening today. I guess we're just going to say something inside this little egg. Okay, come on, open. Alright, so I, since I can't open it, um, I did open it already, but it is this, you know, f cleansing facial brush thing, and it vibrates and whatnot. And so, yeah. And it's supposed to clean your face, so I have a face cleaner thingy. Now, the following items I got from my um, sister's house. Santa made a pit stop there too. Um, Santa also brought me at Natalie's house the Starbucks candle, as well as this set of lotion and um, perfume from Victoria's Secret. And it's called the Tease Rebel we're rebellious clearly <laughs> and it smells really good my favorite part of it is that it's purple and I love purple purple is my favorite freaking color okay so the next thing that Santa got me that you guys are probably thinking is super random they actually came out with this like a long long time ago and I remember seeing the commercials for it you're gonna look at it and be like what in the world is this okay so it's this hook that you put it right here whenever you go to like a restaurant and whatnot and you're not going to put your purse on the chair behind you. Instead, you put it at the table next to you and you just put this on and then you hang your purse. So this is a purse hanger thingy. The following items is the makeup category. So I'm just going to go through them quick. Um, they're mostly drugstore makeup. Well, pretty much they're all drugstore makeup. So the first thing is I got an eyeshadow color palette. And this one's in LA Colors and it's in the plums. This is more kind of like in the purple shady with some brown. So I'm actually pretty excited to use this. So thank you, Santa. Then Santa got me this Shein Liquid Matte Glaze. I don't know what color it is, but you guys can guess. It's kind of like a pink nudish sort of ordeal. Then Santa also got me a contouring stick, which I've never used in my life. Here's the dark side. Here's the light side. Never used a contouring stick in my life, but there's a first time for everything. In case you heard, that was Blinky crying again in the background because he's a crying little bee. And you guys can fill out that word. And of course, I mean beautiful butterfly. Now, the next thing was I got this glaze lip gloss. And it is a super intense color, extra glossy finish. Wow, guys. That was a really long name for lip gloss, too. But um, the seal's still on, so I haven't tried it out. So I can't give you my honest opinion of it, other than the packaging looks really cute. Now the next thing I got was this eyeshadow and it's from Ulta, it's called, it's the Brilliant Color Eyeshadow. I guess it's just like one of the singular ones and this is in the color, I don't know. But it looks like a brown sort of thing, guessing from the back if maybe that is the actual color, but you never know. Actually, I'm going to open it and let you know what color this is because I'm curious now. I wonder if this is like a brown because the back shows like it's a brown, but we just never know, do we? Oh yeah, it is a brown. Oh, this is loose powder, so it's like a really, really dark brown. This could definitely be useful for filling in my eyebrows. Okay. It's good for eyebrows. It's probably, I've got a bunch of eyeshadow powder on myself. 
but this is a nice dark brown I wonder if it matches my eyebrow colors something I'm gonna be testing on then Santa also brought me this lip pencil it's kind of like this darkish brown I've never used really a lip pencil and whenever I try to it doesn't come out good so we'll see how that goes um, then Santa got me an orange pen and oh I thought this was eyeshadow stuff oh my gosh no it says I love nail art and it's a pen in the color orange I've never used something like this this is so cool okay so I'm gonna be doing my nails with an orange pen now and I can make some pen art I don't know how I'm gonna do that but <laughs> we're gonna test it out then Sansa got me a another lip gloss and it is the glaze super intense color extra glossy finish guys and so this one's a little bit different color than the last one so it's less pink it's more like on a nude side then if blinky please stop crying i have a wet and wild step wonder step one wonder gel and it's like this purple yeah it's purple guys oh there we go we got some purple here um so it's in this purple color um this is kind of like having gel nail polish without having to use the uv lights and it says one step so you don't have to do the one two three steps you just now, gotta do one this is gonna be a little bit random this is actually for my kitchen um if you guys haven't known this little hack that I'm about to tell you but if you go to Ross like Santa did this year and you go to like the kitchenware sort of thing and their seasoning you're not gonna find the regular salt pepper sort of thing you're gonna find lemon pepper salt all mixed in one you're gonna find jalapeno salt you're gonna find like all these sort of different assortment random thing that you're like oh my god this is so good and you can never find it again but they only pop up in Ross and at a super low, low price that I'm just so grateful for. So Santa made a little pit stop at Ross and got me a jalapeno salt. Now guys, if you know me personally, then you guys know that I am low-key a little nerd when it comes to Harry Potter. So every year, Santa always get me gets me something related to Pototo and this year Santa got me this cute little Harry Potter special edition playing card set I don't play with cards but the fact that it's Harry Potter I don't care I love it um, I'm just gonna keep it with the rest of my collection of Harry Potter stuff but it's these cute little card sets this is the first one the first deck here's what the back looks like and then the other one is the Quidditch style sort of thing. Oh, wait, no, no. That's the other side. Um, yeah, it's like, I don't even know. The house is on the front. And then we have the Quidditch in the back sort of thing. So that is the Harry Potter related item that I got this year. Every year, and it always gets me something Harry Potter related because I love it. Moving on to hair stuff. Um, this has been lately in the fashion trend, guys. You guys know exactly what I'm talking about. Everybody has been obsessed with having hair clips, but not just any type of hair clips. We gotta have some big old hair clips with some pearls on it. So Santa got me a couple of these. This is just one type of style. Then in here is, I have, you know, ones with in a heart shape just gonna put it all in my hair honestly this makes me feel like I'm 12 years old but um, all the cool girls are wearing it and it's fashionable so I'm wearing it too and I think it's super cute and it's back in style and I love it so that is another thing that Santa got me and then here's another pair as well that just contain a bunch of little different styles and this is all from Shein um, Santa really went 
went at it when it came to Shein, and Shein must love Santa. All right, so the last thing that I'm so, so excited to share with you guys is um, something that I actually got from my company. Santa decided to do Christmas shopping a little bit early, and on Black Friday, we were having a sale, and so Santa used my link, and it's listed down below, just saying. Um, and got me something that I really wanted and it was the two-in-one iconic hairbrush and not only that it came with also a bunch of styling products but I want to show you the hairbrush first so it comes in this cute little baggie along with the box and our hairbrush I've already tried it even though I said in this video I didn't try anything I tried this um, and literally guys i was able to straighten my hair in three minutes at the low lowest heat possible i even used the iconic button even though i have no clue what that is for but i never thought I, that i would be using a hair straightener brush or uh, that i would be interested in something like that and i honestly didn't think it would work but i was definitely really intrigued so when I saw this under the Christmas tree, I was super excited. And the fact that not only does it come with the hairbrush, it comes with a bunch of other products. So I really, really needed some more shampoo and conditioner. So it came with exactly what I needed specified for my hair because in this company, everything is prescribed and completely made for your hair. So what you need is not exactly what the other person's needs are we all have different hair so our hair is very different and unique to one another so i got the smoothing shampoo which is for rebellious frizzy hair aka my hair and then i got the smoothing deep conditioner again it's for the exact same thing it's just helping you with all that frizz the tangliness giving you you know those beautiful curls that you have what without the crazy looking like lion's hair sort of deal then it came with two styling products and it is the frizz fix smoothing hair primer and if you live in florida you know what humidity does with your hair you know exactly what it does you look like a freaking poodle within five minutes of walking out of your home but not anymore because we got the Frizz Fix Smoothing Hair Primer to fix all of that. And I had this in the past, but I do a lot of giveaways. I use it on other people's hair. I use it in my hair. So, you know, over time I ran out. Then it also came with the Thermal Protect Styling Shields. Because guys, if you're using heat in your hair, and even though you're using... Monet shampoo and conditioner using all the styling products you have to make sure that you have a heat protectant in your hair as well because you don't want to harm your hair from the heat you're using so it came with this bad boy which I love then it also came with this really cute bag in the front and no one of the sides it's in French but the other side in case you don't know how to read French like myself it says great hair good vibes XO let's go and then on the bottom it says Monet um, what it should say is great hair good vibes XO XO gossip girl but this isn't gossip girl this is Monet but that is the last thing for when it comes to the hair product style. I am almost done, guys. You are probably annoyed with this video. Like, shut up, Mary, and then get to the end. We're tired of this. So On to the last and final thing, guys. Gift cards. Who doesn't love gift cards? Because I do. So I've recently been going to the gym, working out, blah, 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 blah. And I've been doing this well before the new year has started so i can't say new year new new me new gym membership because i've been going to the gym for the past like three months or so so um santa natalie decided to get me a lululemon gift card which is perfect because i've never owned a pair of lululemons and this would definitely help when i go to drop that big old money on one pair of freaking leggings and I'm not sure if I want to get leggings or joggers. I haven't actually even looked. But I have a lot of leggings. And I kind of want joggers. If 
but I also want leggings, you know? So I'm just like up to the debate, but um, this will definitely come in handy when I go to the cashier. Then the next thing I got was something I really needed is a hands and stone massage and facial spa. Who doesn't love a free massage or facial? I'm probably gonna go for the massage if I'm being completely honest and I'm super excited to use this. Then the last thing is I got this super cute, you know, Christmas card from my sister and she just wrote a really sweet message and you know, I'm not gonna read it out loud, but I just wanted to share this with you guys and I appreciate you guys listening to me ramble on for very long and I feel like this video is going to be quite long but again thank you so much for sticking it out with me and you know watching the video to the end if you did watch the video to the end you're a real one just saying um but thank you so much again for watching if you're new here do not forget to hit that subscribe button also comment down below I'm new here I would love to welcome you welcome you to the family and I'll see you guys very soon Adios.